about it, we talked about it today on the we talked about it today on the show and we were like, that's messed up. What's happening? Just a slight kerfuffle. What no happened? Deal. You biked into the car? No, nothing. It was just a kerfuffle. <laughs> slight, mis slight miscommunication. Uh, he didn't understand, I didn't understand his, his dialect uh -huh. because he was speaking Dutch mixed with English. Oh, no, Wait. I got my damn dictionary. You're not, you're not, what you're not about to do is embarrass me on my own show with some okay. words. So as you speak, brother, I will be looking if I don't understand. And I'm going to do the best I can to keep it, you know what I'm saying, on the third, fourth grade level. Uh, oh, I appreciate I'm that. I'm going to do the best I can. Nah, I'm just joking, man. Like, to be honest with you, I just like to speak where people understand me. And if I say something that you don't understand, right. And just ask me and I tell you. Right, right. That's right. why I learn all that's why I get my vernacular. Right, right. But you know it's funny, me, you tell me, I'm not from the South, and it seems like southern people sometimes and the young brothers don't speak with full English words. They break them up. So for someone like yourself to use those words Yeah, I'm an anomaly. Uh, on the motherfucking bullshit, it's in the A's. No, this is odd. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. Usually it's music and lights and weed. Like this is all y'all motherfuckers looking at me, eyes full of expectations, not knowing what to expect. Hoping I just throw out a big word arbitrarily. <laughs> If anybody don't understand some of the words that I'm saying as the ambassador of big words, I just ask that you raise your hand and let me know. I'll come to you and we'll talk about it some. What's the worst thing about jail? You know, I'm fascinated by jail. I mean, the lack of freedom. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> I appreciate that. But, but, but nah, just... man, no women, no. I mean, you want to get into specific detail? No, no. women, no children, and being kind of how can I say, ostracized. I mean, because people, they, because you know, when people feel that they have some sort of a control over you, they deal with you in a different way. Hey, baby, baby. Man, open the motherfucking gate, cuz. All that fake ass police shit you doing, nigga, open the motherfucking gate, man. Yes, ma'am. They don't talk to me like that, man. Cuz, you sleep. You waking up and trying to motherfucking exert some authority. But my nigga, you sleep, bro. I got you on tape, sleep. Can you tell me that? Man, nigga, when I said the same shit, nigga. Man, eagle, nigga, when I said that shit, nigga, open the motherfucking gate, nigga. Do your job, nigga, and hit that button. Fuck is wrong with you? Man, hit the motherfucking button, nigga. Man, hit the motherfucking button! Using big words like I'm T.I. Now about this lobster here, you said you didn't want no lobster. You gave your lobster away and told, and said you was good. You gave your lobster away and said, I don't need no lobster, I just share his. And here you in, no, you didn't share, you commandeered man. You took the whole lobster. You didn't even want to eat. You took the whole goddamn lobster. The whole lobster. Now look at you. <laughs> that sacrifice, and I never looked back after that. Well, actually, eh. Don't go there, man. <laughs> what I mean is, I don't want to paint the picture as though as soon as I made that sacrifice that everything in my life became, you know, opulent. Okay. okay. You dig what I'm saying? There yeah. was still uh, some adventurous moments uh -huh. financially that I had to endure, you know what I'm saying? And that sacrifice, me choosing to go through that rather than go back to something that I know could pay me right quick. But I sacrificed a good time now to have a great time later. And I feel like that's- Like, no, like I think that's the first time I've ever had that reaction at all in life. Wow. <laughs> so it doesn't give you pause, no, you know? It actually, but look though, it actually it actually gives me a new a new place to, to, to begin from. Because when you go through things and you do things the same and you always know going into it, it's gonna go phenomenally well. It begins to become mundane yeah. and redundant. Yeah. Now I have an opportunity to grow, to build, and I love that. 